Hey, but he is dropping a level, so that should help. He can do it from off the pace. He can do it on the front. So we'll see what catch driver Brody McPhee works out for screen test. But this guy is just a talented veteran. Uh, 41 time life, lifetime wins, and uh, he could uh, definitely get it done here. I wouldn't be surprised, uh, especially moving in a spot here with the scratch of the six. Seven to two, nice price on him. The field for the seventh, lining up in behind the Metro Home Building Center starting gate back upstairs to track announcer Vance Cameron. Three trick gainer, St. Charles Fireball, Burnout Hanover. One rock, cheeky play, screen test, silver spirit, top of the stretch. Here they come. Rough and pacing, three trick gainer will lead them out. Second into the turn, that's Burnout Hanover at the rail. St. Charles Fireball will be third. Now in fourth is One Rock, about to take fifth. On the turn is Screen Test, then Cheeky Play is sixth, and the early trailer, Silver Spirit, along the back stretch with Burnout Hanover. Now on the lead, in line to Brady Sweet. Three trick gainer gives way for the two hole ride, racing from third. St. Charles Fireball, fourth along the inside. As they race on by, the quarter is one rock, and a quarter went 28 and two. Racing fifth is Green Test, moving six on the outside. That is Silver Spirit, and now the trailer. Cheeky play. Down the stretch they come. They have the half mile in their sights, led by Burnout Hanover. In the two hole, it's three trick gainer. Third up the rail, St. Charles Fireball. Screen test first up, fourth. Following the cover on the outside, fifth. That's Silver Spirit. One rock is now six, followed by the trailer, who is Cheeky play, 58. And one a half a mile, approaching the 5H. Burnout Hanover is the leader. Now at his wheel is Screen Test second. Third in the pocket is three trick gainer. Fourth on the outside, Silver Spirit. On the rail, fifth is St. Charles Fireball. One rock is six. Cheeky play on the outside, seventh. By the three quarters, led by Burnout Hanover in one. 27 and 2. In at the rail, three trick. Gainer is second. Back to third is screen test. Up the rail, St. Charles Fireball. Homeward bound. Burnout Hanover trying to close it out. Three trick. Gainer is second. St. Charles Fireball third. Burnout Hanover landing on the line to go all the way for Brady Sweet second. That's three trick. Gainer, St. Charles Fireball third. The trip in one. 56 and a one. Uh, this is exactly what I thought would play out here in this seventh race as we get a look at the Universal Media slow mo. Brady Sweet and Burnout Hanover would. Uh, demand the lead they got to the front i thought three trick gainer and hughes would push out from the rail and maybe get a nice two hole ride and they did and that's the way they sat screen test came first up for mcphee there at the half 58 and 1 127 and 2 and then screen test got a little tired fade it late burnout hanover kicks off the top turn and draws off here to win a nice win for him 56 and 1 picking up his fourth uh, of the season and his 40th lifetime win. Burnout Hanover and Sweet get it done in the seventh.
We're now in Hanover arriving at the winner's circle for the 40th time of his career. Bay pacing galling eight by Welshhead from the Camelock Dam burning point. Home of the Orwell Bay Stable of Orwell, bred by Hanover Shoe Farms of Pennsylvania. Trained by Jeff Holmes, Brady Sweet will guide him to win number 40. The mile 156 and 1. Bird out Hanover in the seventh. 